the Vogel State Park. I will say it is a very curvy <laughs> road to get up here and very steep. <laughs> No, we do not. Pass? Yeah, okay. Either one is a pull. You already paid off the site, so it's just five dollars okay. for the all checked in. Yeah, we'll go to site 61. That was really a very pleasant experience. This is a very nice place. You can tell from the moment you come in. One thing for sure that you need to know is so not only do you have to pay for your campsite, you also have to pay a one-time fee of five dollars to get into the park unless you have a park pass. So just know that. I think it's worth it though. So far it looks like yeah, a nice place. It's beautiful. We're going to meander around and see if we can find our campsite. I got to turn around. I saw a detour sign and thought it didn't apply to me, but it does. Hmm. Bunch of maintenance work. Can't get there from here. Man. Figure out how to get through here. Site. Lynn's going to get out and make sure I can back in and get in the right spot and then we'll um, we'll start this adventure here at Vogue. This campsite. This is awesome. Got a creek right behind us. Maggie's going to love it. Got a back up between some trees. Here's what I'm looking at out the mirror to make sure I'm lined up on that side. And then over here I'm now going to check the left side. Usually, you want to try to keep it close to the left side. Okay. Okay, I'll try to go around that, and I'll try to get over to the left side. Yeah, this is... This wouldn't be easy to get in if you were in a big rig, i got to tell you, but for us, I think... It's a piece of, I wouldn't say it's a piece of cake, but it's always hard to try to figure out the very first time. Okay, stop. Got it? You have a place to walk around the back okay. and on the bikes. Okay, look okay? Yeah, that's good. You got your own screen. Come on, let's go look at it. Oh, well, man, you're right off the back of our site here. Look at this, buddy. Okay. Is it good water? Would Jim say it's mighty fine H2O? What do you think? So just look how big the site is. Picnic area here, a little grill, a fire pit area right by the stream, and then all of this room back here and the stream and nothing that you can see above us except maybe bears and deer. Pretty awesome. So we have one bar of LTE with Verizon. Let's see how much we have with T-Mobile. Looks like we have two bars of 4G, no 5G here, but two bars of 4G should help a lot. We should be able to do something with that. So an update on the uh, cell phone connectivity here at Vogel. There's very, very limited cell phone connectivity here. Looks like we maybe have one 
maybe one bar of Verizon, but it's not bringing in anything back. T-Mobile is zero, no service. Don't know about AT&T because we don't carry that. So there you go. It's going to be a quiet couple days, but you know what? Every now and then that's okay, isn't it? Well, we finally got our bikes off and look what we're doing. We're riding around Bogle State Park, just checking it out and seeing what there is here. Is this thing on backwards? <laughs> Nope. <laughs> we always forget how much we love being on the bikes until we get them down. There's no better way to explore someplace you don't really know than riding around on these e-bikes. You're not afraid of heels. You just go where you want to go and, well, it's just fun. Even if your back's kind of hurting, this hasn't been hard at all other than maybe the little bumps and things. But I think we're both enjoying it and we're going to keep going and explore and see what we can find. Who are you going like this for? I'm so <laughs> uh, You educated really rear end. I thought your brain was working. Uh, it might have been. I was having to think about it. Oh. Be careful going down this hill. Well, I'm kind of walking. I think we should find a place to stop down there and go get on one of those swings by the water. Okay. Save me a spot. Save me a spot. These look brand new. We're going to take Maggie down to the lake loop and let's uh, see if both of us can make it around that. I think all three of us. For all three of us counting Maggie. You know Maggie she'll is. make it. She'll be pulling us. Probably. It's a beautiful campground too guys. It's just gorgeous. It's so pretty around our campsite it's really hard to uh, make yourself leave and go do something else. Like the lake trail is one mile. Just a little spur trail off of the main lake loop trail, but man, that was worth walking all oh, the way yeah, here that for. Oh yeah, waterfalls. <laughs> just, We've been into waterfalls this trip, it seems like. <laughs> it's a Georgia waterfall. That's true. That's it. Maggie wants to keep going, but we're going to head back up the uh, spur trail to the main loop trail. 
we moved out of the way of that truck so we wouldn't get run over. It turned out it was Benny Vargas who was a, a subscriber and watches our videos and they're camping here this week too. And so you may see them later. They may come by the campsite. I always love running into folks that watch our channel. It's really cool. If you've watched us for any time, then you may not agree, but I gotta tell you, the best meal for us is a simple meal. And tonight, the first step in making this simple meal is to do this. We're having hot dogs tonight, roasted over the fire. Is your tail wagging? Now you think she's gonna get a hot dog? I think it is. Is that a happy tail? <laughs> it is. How many do you want? Just one? One? You don't want two? <laughs> My God. <laughs> this is looking good. Mine's cooking slower. Probably because I'm hogging the fire. Mine already. Looking good, looking good. On a poteet. Wow, you're dropping stuff. Mm. Good. Mm -hmm. Nothing better than a hot dog cooked over a fire. That's the greatest. That's just stuff. Simple meals are the best meals. Around the fire, beside the people you care about. Turn cold, perfect night. Wish you were here with us, but not enough hot dogs. So mommy cut up Maggie's so it's in really small bites. She's gonna get some hot dogs here. Eat it slow. Eat it slow. No way is there. No. Boy, the plate tastes better than your dog food now, doesn't it? Yeah. Mm. Mm. It's a lazy day at the campsite. Rain coming from uh, Hurricane, now Tropical Storm Nicole. It's gonna hit us here at Vogel State Park tonight about nine o'clock. I guess our only worries are that we're underneath trees, but it looks like we're pretty safe and we're kind of hunkered down for the night. And an interesting thing about this campground, there's no cell phone coverage here at all. They do have Wi-Fi down at the visitor center, but it's, uh, it's pretty slow too so we've downloaded books and movies and other things to watch and prepared for this and so now it's just going to be an evening of lying around and watching things on the ipad and well just relaxing and getting ready to make a big trip tomorrow i hope everyone's safe We survived the night last night as Nicole, the tropical storm or the remnants of it, came blowing through the mountains of Georgia. We we're at Vogel State Park and had a great time. We did. We? It was, it's been awesome. We didn't get to do as much as we wanted to because of the rain yesterday, but um, it will definitely be on our comeback to visit list for yeah, sure. It, we met a few subscribers while we were here. We learned a lot of things that we should have done while we were here. And we'll uh, we'll take advantage of that next time we're here. Because within 30 miles of this place, there's just a ton to there do. Is. Hikes and waterfalls and 
I think the Appalachian Trail actually goes through a building here. There's a lot yeah. of things that happen. Yeah, but the park itself was absolutely gorgeous. And, you know, we enjoyed the park as much as we could. So. And I don't know if we mentioned it yesterday or not, but while we were putting the bikes on, uh, just some fluke way of me turning, I hurt my back a lot yesterday. But we followed the instructions most of you have given us, and this morning it's good enough that we're going to continue our trip, which means we're heading to the southwest part of Georgia. We're in the northwest part now. We're heading to the southwest part to head to Seminole State Park in Georgia. Thanks for joining us this week, and we hope you'll keep following along. <laughs> Owen's putting the camera on the front of the van so we can get a drive-through shot of the campground. And he's getting a little wet. It's going to be a probably a miserable day driving today. But hey, I guess you got to do it. There he goes. <laughs> <laughs> 